Good morning, Harrison. It's Friday, January 10th, 2020, and these are your morning announcements. My name is Brooklyn. And my name is Wadad. Today we have four students from Mrs. Duncan's class to help us with, with, with the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand. I am Seth. I am Larry. I'm Esther. to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I am a peacemaker. I pledge to recognize the good people to, to make positive choices and help others to do the same. I will build peace at school, at home, and in my community every day. Thank you. For lunch today, there will be whole grain double stuff pizza, green beans, sliced peaches, and milk. As always, that sounds amazing. Now for our Harrison birthdays. There are no Harrison birthdays today. Adriana Glaze has a birthday on Saturday, and there are no Harrison birthdays on Sunday. Now let's talk attendance. The December Perfect Attendance Classroom Challenge winners were on first floor, Mrs. Brown. On the second floor, an unprecedented three-way tie with Mr. Maletti, Miss Weber, and Mrs. Wyden. All of the winners received a treat this week to celebrate. Congratulations and keep up the good work. The December Perfect Attendance Random Prize winners were Adrian Parks in Mrs. Brown's room, Marlon Purdy and Mrs. Connolly's room, and Zane Gassani and Mrs. Wyden's room. You can check out their award ribbons and the prizes they chose in the Toy Story 4 display case in the main hallway. Congratulations, winners. Who, who knows, maybe you'll be next. Remember, the reward for perfect attendance in January is extra special. For grades kindergarten and first, a Go Noodle dance party. For grades two, three, four, and five, the Kahoot game on iPads. So keep, so keep coming to school every day so you can, so you can earn this fun reward. Now let's go over to Nate with a check on the weather. Today we will see a high of 53 degrees. Wait, 50 degrees in January? That's crazy. But yes, 50 degrees, and we can also see rain. I only predict a 35% chance of outdoor recess. The rain and the warm temperatures will continue into weekend. By Saturday, you will start to see temperatures fall into the 40s and it will get very windy. For your back to school Monday, we see partly sunny skies. As, as always, be sure to dress for the weather and make it a wonderful weather day. Let's go over to Cole with our fun fact assignment. Good morning, it's 2020 and we thought we would highlight some of the most amazing discoveries of 2019. In April of 2019, the event for Horizon Telescope team published the first ever picture of a black hole. Here it is. Climate researchers who study Antarctic and Greenland ice sheets are seeing that they are melting faster than ever seen before. Scientists had thought that the giant squid was extinct, but this year, this animal, which lives 3,300 feet below the ocean waves, was caught on camera. It was amazing. Research, researchers at St. Jude Hospital also found a cure for a severe genetic disease called the bubble boy syndrome. And finally, archaeologists uncovered the largest number of coffins in Egypt in a century, and scientists pulled DNA of a piece of chewing gum that was that is 5,700 years old. From that DNA, they could see that the girl who chewed it may have looked like this. It will be a 
exciting to see what amazing discoveries 2020 will bring. You can discover amazing discoveries in your very own Harrison Library. Back to you, anchors. Thanks so much, Cole. Wow, gum that is over 5,000 years old? That's crazy. Yes, it is. Now it's time to end our newscast with a joke. Why did the chewing gum cross the road? Oh, so awful. Why did the chewing cr gum cross the road? Because it was stuck to the chicken's foot. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great weekend. weekend. This, this is with Dad, or known as Mo Bertha, Nate, Brooklyn, Harvey, always is, party. And this is Cole Coletti. Make sure to eat your spaghetti. <laughs> the news is in, and we are out. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two.